Kiara Kotoka Toa, welcome to KS Teaching on Violence Targeting Transgender Women and Hate. This particular teaching is organized in response to the organizing of hate targeting transgender women that uh, we are seeing currently in El Teroa and particularly with the arrival of uh, Posey Parker this uh, weekend. Alongside white supremacist discourse, then we uh, see discourses um, uh, articulated by trans-exclusionary radical feminists who um, will put forth the argument, and this is a key argument in the process of othering, uh, that transgender women are not women. So that work of othering then is used to particularly produce stigmas and um, uh, call for various forms of exclusion. Now, here's the uh, critical point, particularly when it comes to trans-exclusionary radical feminists, is uh, the placing of these arguments as a communicative inversion. So if you're familiar with uh, the work of the culture-centered approach, communicative inversion is the turning of materiality on its head in order to portray the opposite. This is a strategy that is consistent um, that is consistently used in fascist uh, strategies of erasure uh, in order to legitimize forms of violence. And we certainly see that in trans-exclusionary radical feminist discourse, especially in terms of the ways in which it uses the language of radical feminism, the language of um, women's rights to fundamentally attack the human rights of transgender women and uh, to then legitimize these attacks by uh, noting that transgender women are not really women. And that becomes then the connecting point uh, that uh, feeds into far-right white supremacist discourse. So one of the things that we have seen happen uh, within the context of Posey Parker's um, visit to Australia is the very explicit interplay between Nazis and um, trans-exclusionary radical feminists. Now, this interplay um, in Australia is materialized with um, this particular visit, uh, but it is integral to the discursive infrastructure, particularly in terms of um, the ways in which um, white supremacist, neo-Nazi communicative uh, platforms, digital spaces draw upon the narratives of trans, uh, trans exclusionary radical feminists. The other two points I want to make 